What's happening, guys? Welcome back. All right. <clears throat> so we are supposed to deal with the slithery little creatures um, in the bathhouse. Oh, oh yeah. I see. There's uh, quite a few, okay. ain't there? I can either kill them one by one or flood them with cold water. All right. I'm gonna go flood them with cold water. Um, no point in killing him. So... Random dude. Sorry. Opening it should flood the bath and get rid of the snakes. <sighs> All right. Well then, hopefully that's easy peasy. Making our way downtown. Walking fast, faces past. Yeah. Anyways, all right, let's do a checky check. <gasps> Look, they're gone. Just be like, can you can you hide the body? And I hope he asked me if I had the body. Is the bathhouse free of snakes? I flooded the bathhouse with cold water. Good riddance! Well? Well what? I took care of the snakes. Now you're going to tell me about the Spartan woman and the baby. <laughs> I actually don't know anything. It was before my time. The man who does know is Mivan, but he won't tell you. He won't tell anyone anything. <laughs> <laughs> I like your snakes. At least I got a name. Mither. All right then. <coughs> oh, excuse me. All right. We'll hit that one up. And uh, probably do another thing and learn something else. You probably gotta do all three to be honest. That's how these games work. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh my, what is going on back there? Please help our daughter. Same sickness as May Asclepio spare her from suffering. Will she live? Not unless the gods heed our prayers. Many sick Athenians have arrived in Argolis recently, and very few have left. Shucks. This poor girl has the same sickness. Oh no. Is there anything I can do to help? I was warned of the eagle bearer. Wants nothing but drachmi for blood, I was told. We're wasting time, priest. I can discuss what I want when this sick girl's needs are taken care of. Her illness seems to have no cure, and it's spreading. Our sacrifices have done little to draw the attention of the gods. Pigs, goats, all have fallen on deaf ears. 
We need the beast whose blood will ignite these flames for Asclepios to see. What did you have in mind? There is a rumor of a bull with skin as white as snow roaming the sanctuary outskirts. Head west of here, towards the coast. Bring it to me alive, and we'll offer a sacrifice the gods cannot ignore. I'm touched you will help these people. But I know why you're really here. Chrysis made all priests swear oaths to seal our lips in the face of the eagle-bearing Mystios, or forfeit our lives. But I serve the gods and the sick. My oaths are to them. I'll find sure. this bull for you. Let's do it. Did you know that? Oh, it did not catch it. Okay. Say, bull. The bull grazes grazes in the northern part. The bull was spotted roaming near the ash. Oh, excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, wrong way. Okay. That's where we're headed. Alrighty then. This way. Come on, horsey. Yeah, there we go. Good horse, good horse. Did you like running sideways on a hill? Too late? How am I supposed to bring the bull back? Yeah. Oh shit. They won't ask any questions. Let's keep out of sight. Like that lion do the job. Well, those guys are dead. So I wish that lion would go down there and whip their ass. Let's go try to take. Oh, hello. Oh, damn it, I thought I was... damage. Oh! You fight better than you look. Put 
fight. Wow! Did you just fucking came out of nowhere? God, I hate this shit. Uh. Wow. Just minding my own business. Long-ass waiting screens. Oh my goodness, I'm not going that far back, dang, man. Really? You couldn't have before I got into the battle? What a waste of time that was. Like, why can't you just respawn, like, right before you died or right when you died? Stupid. Job, horsey. The white bull. Am I too late? I know these guys are level nineteen, but dang, I'm level eighteen. Okay, I have a level 16 bow. I mean, that's not too bad. Like, everything I have is... I can't... Okay, if I was level 19, I could equip that. Same with this... well, that one. Have to. It's, that's not that bad either. Um, a level 15 helmet, but. I mean, it doesn't really go with what I have, but. You know, 31 more defense. Sure, sure. I don't really have any uh, other stuff anyways, so, I mean, oh, that was a big jump, that hurt. Oh, 
Oh, dude's fighting a lion. There you go. Lions got it. Oop. That's a big jump. Doesn't look like he died willingly. I'll take his heart for the sacrifice. It'll have to do. Go, sir. And grab this heart. Oh, not the best feeling. That poor bull. Beautiful bull. Oh. I hope this heart is enough. If they want the whole bull. They can come get it themselves. Let's go free this other dude over here just chilling. How can I sneak? Uh, geez. Ancient tablet. You gotta go over there for the ancient tablet. Nope. 
Fuck that. You got a little bitch coming to help you? Nope. Not doing it. Not doing with you guys. Yeah, I guess it'd be quicker just to get my horse. Ooh, what? Ooh, or. Interesting. Look like a chariot race place, maybe? Some kind of races? That's too pathetic to be a gladiator right now. I don't know, it could be one. It could be one. Did you find the white bull? I couldn't bring it back alive. But I did manage to collect its heart. This won't be enough to please us, Clepios. The beast died unwillingly, and with just the heart, we'll only be able to pray for one life. Please, Mythios. The white bull you killed was mine. My farm feeds half of our lease. If I die, people will starve. I beg you! My husband was killed by the sickness. I have two small children. Who will take care of them if I die? I am wealthy and will pay you for this blessing. <coughs> it's okay. Give the sacrifice to them. You did this. You choose whose prayers get heard by the gods. Taking she didn't do it. I know it. what it's like to be small and forsaken. Pray for the girl. You regret this. <laughs> Not an easy choice, Mistios, but it's been made. The rest is in the hands of the gods. I did my part, priest. The Spartan woman you're after. You've met her? Her visit to the sanctuary is legendary, but sadly, it was before my time. The man you want is Midon, the elder priest. He spoke of her often, that is, before he cut out his tongue. Cut out his tongue? When he's not healing the sick, he's in the guest house. Spends a lot of time being tended to by the servants. Thank you. I won't forget you helped me. And these people won't forget you helped them. Ha! <laughs> a priest mace. All right then. Almost 19. Alright, 200 meters. Nice. Don't mind me, don't mind me. Excuse me, bro. Do 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 you can't enter here, Mistios. Turn away. Best stay out of sight. He didn't move, did he?
here to steal. Hmm. It's toughy. This is a restricted area. Okay, my bad, bro. Can't save. Cause I know I'm probably gonna die. So. Let's just <sighs> hop out here real quick. Do a quickie save. I guess she just walks in. Guards! They're dead. And you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him, not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. The Spartan woman. Was her name Mirini? They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. You saved the child. No. He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. Did she tell you where she was going? Do all sanctuary priests take their servants to bed? I am not his servant. We share a sacred bond. A sacred? Right. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my brother here, you and your priests left him for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. 
That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. <laughs> did he? Did he? I don't believe you. Dead? How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky he survived as long as he did. That, that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby! My baby! <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. for that Spartan woman so far from home. Her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Tell me, please. I need to know. Not even Apollo could save the child. Nidon told me how the Spartan woman wept, held the baby in her arms, sang to him, before finally leaving him to the gods. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? There is an altar where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope, priests without tongues, and babies left with an insane woman. <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis, and she's going to pay for what she's done. Damn. She's like, bitch. Hush, my child. May Ira bless our sacred family. Cool, we need that one. Give me six out of seven. And a new piece of ame. Which side is she on? Okay. She over here. She over here. So, Chrysis is the key to finding my mother. I must find this altar of Apollo Maleatas. Oh, stupid me. Ah, as soon as I try to go for the quest thing, it's like, new. <sighs> Southern Eastern part of the Valley of the Dream. Okay. Oh, look, found it. Here, maybe? Let's go, my stallion. Steed, stallion. No. Look, I've just run through this like there's no problem. Let's go. Ella. So it's too south. Go get that. Well, we're a little over time. Uh, next episode, we're gonna have that viewpoint. Try to find this cultist person, murder her, and yeah. Until then, see ya.